Hey, what's going on, Aaron? My name is Dallin, and I am the owner and marketing consultant here at Iron Chest SEO. I'm shooting this video to share with you guys these three uh, free tips uh, to help improve your SEO. Now, I don't want to waste any of your time. I don't want to waste any of mine either. If you guys want some help with this and want to move forward, uh, you know, give me a shout, and we can link up and get some of this done. If not, no harm, no foul. Use these free tips, take them to your current advertising or SEO company and have them start implementing them. So the three things that the search engine uh, goes off of the most is your content, citations, and backlinks. So the first thing we're going to go over today is the content. So Google likes to see anywhere from 1,500 to 2,000 words of content. And of course, in that content, you want to have your high relevant keywords or key phrases in there so as the algorithm is scanning through your website it is picking up saying okay these guys do that service so if I was the Google user and I was living in Tulsa if I wanted pest control services I would go to Google and I would you know most likely Google pest control treatment or pest control Tulsa okay somewhere around there and that's how you would be able to get picked up if you had those keywords in your website so going through here, you guys' website looks very, very good. Uh, just missing the high relevant keywords in a lot of the sections. And also the, the other one is your meta description. So these metas here, uh, also known as alt text, are what your pictures are saved into. So that's another thing that Google Google's algorithm, when it scans through this, it's not seeing this picture. It's just seeing a code. And whatever it's saved in there as, you want to have that keyword in there so it says, oh, okay, this is what this is. It's it's Tulsa Pest Control. That's what it is, okay? Um, so the next thing we're going to go over is the citation. So I'm going to do a quick Google search here. Pest Control, Tulsa, okay. So the first thing up here, I'm sure you're familiar with a lot of this. A lot of people use Google. These are just your local service ads. And then scrolling down, you have your regular Google ads here, all right? And then the next one down is your map pack. I'm sure you're aware that a lot of people go here uh, to find pest control companies, and it's very actually very simple to get into this map pack and get up and ranked high in this in this section. And it's all done off of your citations. So citations are online directories anywhere that you can list your business name, your business address, and your business phone number across the directories in the web is going to give you that ranking factor and get you pushed up to the top so directories can be Yelp LinkedIn yellow pages easy local any one of those types of companies where you can list your name business name address and phone number in it it's giving you that power in Google's eyes saying that you guys are relevant you're listed across 300 different platforms 300 different directories you guys must be important you deserve to be in the top of the map pack that is how it works with Google so scrolling down here this is where the big trust flow is this is your organic traffic okay so this is where you know 50% of the people are going to come in and they're going to click on one of these top three uh, companies here to go and get pest control services so how you get up in the top of the organic is all to do off of your backlinking Backlinking is simply another high authority website like a private blog network or some kind of blog that is relevant to your niche and it's got your website listed in their website. Linking and giving that power back to your website is how you get pushed up in the organic. Okay, so we're going to go in here. We're going to look at a tool that I use called Arifs and I have your uh URL inserted in here. One thing that I noticed first is up here where this this uh, your URL is right here. There is supposed to be a site title right here, and what that site title is telling Google immediately as it comes up to it, it's saying this this you want that keyword in that site title, so it's immediately saying these guys do pest control services in Tulsa. Okay, and I I'll give you an example of that here in a minute. So that's the first thing that I noticed that was missing right here. So as we come in here, you can see that you have 66 referring domains going back to 19.2 thousand backlinks. Okay, but I'm going to show you something about these backlinks because not all backlinks are created equal. You can have 
you know, you can have thousands and thousands of backlinks that have no power and it does your site no good. So what we like to do is we'll come in here and we'll, we'll narrow this down to one link per domain and we'll come over here to this link type and we'll go to the do follow links. What the do follow links means is that is actually a powerful site that is linked to your website. It's mentioning your website in there and it's linked back over. Okay, so these are the only ones that we need to pay attention to are the do follow links. So you can see it takes that 19,000 all the way down to 42, right? So we're going to come over here now and look at your keywords real quick. Okay, so I'm in the keyword section of your website right here, and you can see uh, that some of these were updated. Like this was updated on January 19, 2021, and then these were all updated here about two weeks ago or so. So this is the keywords that's getting picked up in your website. Pest Control, Owasso, you're ranked number four for that keyword. Owasso Pest Control, number four again. So really good. I mean, you guys are probably picking up quite a bit of Owasso traffic, but if you're wanting to go into Tulsa and get more Tulsa work, you'll want more of these Tulsa keywords in here, right? So Tulsa Termite Inspection, uh, Termite Inspection Tulsa, rank number 54 for that. That's that's sitting, there's 10, 10 companies or 10 listings on each page of Google. So this right here is going to be on page six, right? Okay, so I'm going to show you one of your competitors real quick. This is the Guardian Angel. You saw that they were listed at the top of the map pack, and they are also listed at the top of the organic. Okay, so as you could scroll through their site, a lot more relevant content here, right? They have the keyword in there, Tulsa Pest Control, right? That is a high relevant key phrase right here in their header. That's probably their... That is probably their header one, so it's that's one of the things that's getting scanned first, okay? And we're going to go in and check out their, this is their keywords, but I'm going to check out their backlinks, okay? So this is theirs, and this is what I'm talking about with your uh, site titles, right? So Tulsa Pest Control, that's what you're missing on your website, so that's what Google is coming up to their website and they're automatically picking up saying, hey, they do pest control in Tulsa, they have the keyword right there. They got 900, they got 139 referring domains going back to 937 backlinks with a total of 545 keywords and they have a roughly about 291 people visiting their website every month right okay so we're gonna come in here and look at their uh, keywords real quick and you can see how they actually do have these types of keywords in their website and they're ranked number five for them there's hundred and fifty people searching for this every month there's six hundred people searching for this keyword every month so this is why they're dominating you guys they're, they've got these high relevant keywords in there um, that are getting picked up so I hope you found all this information valuable. Again, I don't want to waste any more of you guys' time. Uh, please take these free tips, utilize them, and I wish you guys good luck this year as the swarm season's appearing. Uh, we're down here in Oklahoma City, so I always like working with some local people. Uh, appreciate you. Have a good day.